Good evening, guys. Good evening. Hello. <clears throat> we got a nice chill race this evening. And when I say chill, I mean uh, it's in. We've got some nice company this evening, so I'll let the, uh, let the stream fill up a bit as people tune in. And then, uh, and then we'll get into it. How are you all? Whew. Just finished eight minutes of just spinning away. I get my excuses in early. I've had a four hour ride today. Four hours. <laughs> 2,100 meters of climbing. So I got some tide lights on purpose. <clears throat> We've got some uh, got some backpedal friends in this cafe bash by All Things Ride this evening. If you want to check out the description, find out what's going on. Feeling very grateful this evening. Feeling very grateful. Thank you for joining, everybody. People pressured me into using the GB kit, so it's not a flex, I promise. You know me well enough. <laughs> I'm using it because, well, you know, maybe it's my only ever chance to use it. <laughs> so. I'm using it. <laughs> if you enjoy this stream, give it a like. Thank you so much um, for your support. It is very, very appreciated. Katie, I see you signed up for this. Kelvin also signed up for this. Mick, Ian apparently signed up for this. Um, apparently, people like uh, people like Richmond. Thank you, Zach. I haven't even responded to my YouTube comments yet. How bad of me. Um, but yeah, I'm very very grateful. Thank you for the very kind messages. Um, ah, I'm sorry. <laughs> in dead mode. You're both in dead mode. Oh, okay, so we've got assigned bikes to this. We're on factor bikes. Ooh, I like factor bikes. Not that I've ever ridden one, but I do like a nice. I do like a nice factor bike. So we're on factor bikes and and Zwift wheels by the looks of it. So I know. I'm, well, I'm wearing the shorts. You can't see it, but I am wearing the shorts. I'm going to I've got to break the chamois in, you know. Everybody knows the new the new kit dilemma. I can't like I can't just wear this once because I'll be sliding around on the on the new chamois. So yeah, good evening to all the uh, ATR guys and their uh, respective riders and sponsors. Can we change wheels? We can. Good point, yeah. Well remembered. I'll do that quickly. Oh. It won't let me change. Although technically I've selected them. Oh, there we go. It's changed. That's a nice factor bike, that. It's a nice factor bike. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna enjoy this one. Um Thank you for the congratulations. Uh, I'm going to enjoy this one, um, just have a bit of fun. I've signed up for the Mallorca 312. Shout out to All Things Ride, who I'm heading over there with. And Charlie is as well, actually, funny enough. And, of course, Phil is as well. Phil love it. So, this is, uh, this is a bit of fun this evening. After some hard training this morning, so. I'm obviously going to give it my best, but go easy on me. 
Is that a hint for about the factor bike? <laughs> I wish, Marco. I wish. Factor bikes, if you're listening. That would be mega, wouldn't it? Me on factor bikes. And they do super light rated. Anyway. Here we go, anyway. Here we go. Let's stick around these back pedal jerseys. Yeah, we can afford to be on disc as well there, Tommy, because this could be even lighter. Anyway. Thank you, everyone. Let's make sure I remember to start my uh, Wahoo here. Oh, Rodri's looks stunning, doesn't it, Tommy? Here we go. So like I said, get my excuses in. Been for a massive ride this morning. So go easy on me. Paul Elliott, Nell Bainey, Mick, Mick's here, John's here. Ah, Roger's in the chat. How do you, Roger? Nice short race as well, short and sweet. Although, you know how hard this one, this one is, so it's certainly not easy. I'm going to use Mick as an example on this one, for like this. I'm drafting, practice my drafting. Although run to the climb is pretty early. Thank you, Darren. I might only get one chance in my life, so. <laughs> one chance in my life, maybe, to represent Great Britain, so. As you can imagine, everything now is focused on the Zwift Worlds in just uh, 17 days time, is it? 17 days? So, yeah, the duathlon, I'm still going to be running, still on that duathlon grind, but yeah, the uh, the Worlds now obviously take center, st center stage, as you can imagine. I'm going to do my best. Hence why I'm a little bit, coming into this week, a little bit fatigued. It's all part of that overload. Not quite as much as Tom Pidcock doing 30 hours a week, but you know. Hal Kennedy's there as well. That is you, Hal. Nice. I'll answer, um, I'm making a mental note of these questions, Zach. I will answer them uh, in some videos. I hope you appreciate that 
I can make some nice videos in the run up to this so um, I'm not being I'm not being evasive it's just YouTube allows me to it's a platform where I can answer these questions so yeah I think I'm going to need uh, the little ring for this climb. I don't know. More 100% train difficulty. I think I'm going to die a death. Either way. I feel very hungry, actually. I'm going to get that out there now, actually. I cannot live stream the worlds. I'm not allowed to. Uh, that is officially written in the rule book, unfortunately. But uh, you can still you can still shout for me, <laughs> or shout at me. I'll have to find out, Brian. I don't know if that's possible either. We'll find out. You know, if it is possible, I will do it. I hope so, Tommy. I hope so. I feel very privileged, not only to represent, but to be able to share it, as much as I am. It actually, it actually motivates me as well, so it works both ways.
Good evening, Tim. Even everybody who's just joined. Oh. Trying to make the most of these intervals because it's not often I do this course. So it's nice to have like some solid red and then some like solid, like, well, not recovery, but you know what I mean? It's not very often I get a session, or I call it a session, as structured as this. So. Gotta get our music from there. Cheers and Laura. <laughs> Still won't sign in my kicker, Tim. We're all over it like a rash, though. We're emailing. We're trying to get everything done. No sign of it yet. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll come before next weekend. Oh no, don't worry about it, Tim. It's not for you to sort, buddy. Yeah, everyone's on kickers, yeah. Thankfully, because I'm already on the ecosystem, swap into the new one should be uh, pretty easy, right? Who's using feather going downhill? Blow my neck.
No, you don't get to keep the kicker. It has to go back for lab testing. <laughs> That's the truth. <laughs> Yeah, that's it, Ian, yeah. I'm saving mine for when you launch a suicide attack and I and I can't hold the wheel, because... Yip was selected for the Canadian squad. I did wonder. This race is over quick, isn't it? After what I've done already, killed it. Mm. My legs are not sharp. Thank you, Phil. Thank you, Josh. Come on, back belt boys. <coughs> Ian, hill climb champion. <sighs> you got it, buddy. Go on, Nick. Tick them off one at a time.
Come on in. Oh, I was a max there. Well, that's a max when I'm tired. My heart rate's super, like, sluggish. It's alright though. A bit of tired racing doesn't hurt anybody. Come on, Mick. Ian, if anybody goes here, I'll try and keep it together you got some solid kicks in you far better than me anyway especially as the group isn't that small now Press, press, press. Go on in, go on.
Oh, don't hit me right <sighs> Proud of you. Great commitment. Oh, I'm pretty proud of myself as well. So, I really like struggled there where it went, where it went at the end, where it eased up and then yip attacked. Well, he, did, he just pushed 10 watts of heel. I couldn't respond to it. My gear jumped or wouldn't change, it wouldn't go down. And uh, I was stuck then, like sort of half hesitating. But uh, I can be happy with that after four hours endurance this morning. You know, Tom Pidcock style of preparation. <laughs> Although I'm nowhere near Tom Pidcock's level, so. Oh my word. Yeah, for sure, Zach, yeah. And it wasn't even like massive, well, I say massive numbers, it was massive numbers, but it was, like I said, a 10 watts per kilo pushing away there. Rather than uh, like 15 watts per kilo or something. Oh, flip back. Oh, I tell you what. If any of you, I know a couple of you actually, but if any of you like ever want to like really like push the boat out, as long as you're capable of sort of like if you're if you're in good shape, like don't try and do it when you're like early on in a training cycle, but like when you when you're like pushing for really peak shape, like try and look for try and look for like what's the next progression and like this is like one of the things like doing a solid aerobic endurance ride and then you know this is what his whiffer is in a so often because it's so accessible like this Whew. yeah for sure pros yeah yeah yeah, yeah. no good job Ian good job well good job everybody Um, well, uh, it's a good question, Kelvin. Um, for those of you that don't follow me on Strava, the ride is there, but yeah, so the ride, so early on, maybe the first two hours, the, um, it, w it was a lot sort of flatter, or, or, the, or the climbs weren't as like uh, fast, uh, sorry, the descents weren't as fast, but um, Later on in the ride, I had no option but to freewheel on the descents. Um, but I, w I definitely didn't focus on, I didn't specifically go out there and go like, oh, I'm going to stay in zone two. Sometimes I do, it depends on the session. Usually, actually, if I'm going to do that, like as, if I'm going to say, oh, I'm only going to do zone two, it's usually when it's like a two hour ride or three hour ride. But if, um, if it's a, uh, if it's like a five, six, seven hour ride, I wouldn't bother. Because the philosophy is, it's a bit like when you see the pros for like, you know, the World Tour teams go out on training camp. The reason, often the reason why they do like seven, eight hour rides is because when they're in the group, they're doing a lot of like freewheeling and soft pedaling. So that's why they just ride longer. So, yeah. Like, as a great example like this round the wheel round wheels race I'm gonna do which is a thousand kilometers like I'm definitely not gonna aim for like stay in zone two you know um, you know it, it translates do you know what I mean oh how good effort though you're pushing uh, pushing some big watts per kilo I spotted it quite a few times so well done but well done hey Tim you're supposed to be a team manager and you're, you're like, come on, race, 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 dance, monkey, dance. <laughs> Shows how good you are as a team manager. <laughs> I don't know, no, I, I, won't, I won't do a race. I won't do another race. Come on. I've got a three hour hard hilly ride tomorrow. Um, I want to try and do some longer climbs like so I'm back up today, so like this morning was 2,100 meters of climbing in that four hour ride. And I want to 
push the boat out a little bit tomorrow. So tomorrow morning I'll do three hours and uh, I'll do some um, like longer climbs, maybe 15, 15 minute climbs. Sorry, the wind is uh, some 15 minute climbs or at least over 10 minute climbs and I'll try and ride them at like sweet spot or just under threshold somewhere like that. Oh. <laughs> Two old fire rides. <laughs> it's a long climb. Right, as we phrase tomorrow, I'll be right. <laughs> oh. I do want to say, um, I know some, some people have tuned out now anyway because the race is over, but you know, Tim's here. Tim, I've virtually ever since I started Zwift racing, Tim has. Uh, Tim has been somewhere there in the background um, and I reluctantly did start as with racing uh, Christian House got me into it um, and um, yeah and then I was sort of taken under the wing of Cycling Hub and how that progressed and it's funny isn't it when you look back on it all it's like <laughs> and then you know all you guys and then you know being here from the beginning or come along for the ride Quite literally. Yeah, it's mental, isn't it? It's mental. Oh, I'll, well, you give it everything. Give it everything. Oh. <laughs> it's all your fault. <laughs> it's all your fault. I just want to have a look at the graph actually while everybody's still here. Almost 500 watts for a minute. Look at that, that's nice isn't it? That's really nice. I always like the graph when I race here or when I race in like Innsbruck Ring. I, l I like a clean graph where it's like either or. You know when you just have like a flat sort of graph? I don't know. I, I kind of like this, this, this graph where there's like either red or grey. <laughs> the super chat, yeah. Prez is... Prez is feeding me. And um, Prez is... Uh, yeah. It, I'm, I'm going to come out to see you Prez one day and, and thank you personally and uh, come and ride some bikes or something you know should we ride some bikes <laughs> at BC Nationals yeah they were the days they were the days yeah thank you. I mean it truly means uh, it's not often I might not ever ever get a chance to pull in on the British Champs jersey ever again so Although, you know, saying that, it could be, this could be the, the start of something, you know, while cycling could pick me up, I could be riding in the Commonwealth Games. Anything could happen. <laughs> Anything could quite literally happen. Um, I mean... You're kind of right, Marco, but you know this is the this is the career of sort of chosen, isn't it? And um, the career path, and you know, as much as you know, you the hard work goes into it from from day to day. You know, it's it's no different to a normal job, really, in that sense. Well, in the sense that you know you sort of always switched on and you're always working, and that goes for like me as a you know as a mentor. And me as a coach, and, and me as an athlete, you know, and it, the YouTube stuff, and, it, and everything, like, I, and it, and it all goes back into it, you know. I, I invest a lot heavily in what I do because, you know, I I won't ever really get a chance to do it again because, you know, you're only young once and stuff, isn't it? And, um, you know, I I chose this route really, and as hard as it is 
sometimes and as easy it is some as easy as it is sometimes yeah, you, you do get reminded it's kind of worth it um, yeah it'd be good that would work Kelvin yeah but let's just focus on the world for now <laughs> Yeah, that's true, Mick. Yeah, uh, yeah. Quick step to my stuff. Hi, Jason. Although I don't think Jason writes him anymore. I don't know. Yeah, but that is very true, and that is very, very true. Yeah, very true. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, um, thank you, Marco. I'm uh, I'm going off for some food now. I want to uh, thank you all for for watching and supporting this journey in uh, whatever way that is. Um, you know I'm going to give it my best, and um, I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward. Great race, everybody. Yes. Definitely, Ian. <laughs> Definitely. A hundred percent, Rick. hundred percent. So, yeah. All videos now and all training geared towards the Zwift Worlds. And, of course, Climbers Gambit on Monday. So, I will see you for that race on Monday. That's probably going to be my next live stream, maybe. So, you've got a couple of days to wait. But until then, you'll know that I have some videos. So, thank you so much, everybody. Have a good evening. Have a good day. Deja vu, Mick. Deja vu. See ya.